Oh. Ancient RC artifact. Hmm, that looks like a uh, X Max tire. What's up, guys? Back out on the bash field. I know it's been a pretty long time since I've uploaded a video. I've had several guys reach out to me uh, asking if I'm all right and stuff, which I really appreciate it. Honestly, I just needed to take some time off. You know, this is a, you know, there is a lot to making these videos, especially at the caliber that I run at. Um, and I just needed to take a long break. It's been five years of constant weekly uploads. And uh, it just felt good to take some time off and uh, spend some more time with the family. My job's been taking a lot more of my time here lately too, but it's just been nice to take a little break, uh, step back. Um, but I still enjoy RC and uh, I've been dying to get back out here. It's, uh, I've definitely uh, got the urge to send something. So I, um, I got my Trugified Typhon TLR tuned right here. And then my Team Corrali Asuga, uh, big 1 7 scale style buggy truggy. So it's an awesome rig. I had a blast driving that thing last video. We'll go to it first. It's still completely stock. It just has a 16 tooth pinion in it, uh, but it's super fast. It handles really good. I mean, it's definitely a, a, a good mix between a buggy and a truggy. So if, you, if that's what you're looking for, this is your cup of tea right here. I got the Arma Typhon TLR tuned right here, which I did truggify with M2C um, hexes on here, uh, plus five millimeter, I believe. And these are uh, Team Corrali Skeeter 4S tires, which are perfect tires for this platform. Um, they're kind of low profile. They're fast. They don't balloon too bad um, But it's just a perfect tire for a for a truckified Typhon This thing is pretty much all stock still except for m2c chassis braces uh, Still has the TLR tune 775 chassis on it Which uh, has a little bit of a, a little bit of a wave in it But it's not too bad con uh, considering the last bash that it took just to recap because it's been so long as far as the electronics goes It does have the spectrum 2050 kV motor uh, with a 17 tooth pinion BLX 185 ESC and the Power HD waterproof 23 kilogram servo. And also it has the M2C Racing chassis braces, top plate, upper suspension block, and a front tower. Still got the stock TLR tower in the back. It's uh, holding up pretty good so far. I haven't jumped in a long time, so it's gonna, so uh, forgive me if I fudge up a couple of them, but we're gonna get out and have fun anyway. All right guys, let's see what's up. Oh, that was rough. Ooh, sound like a motor mount shifted. <laughs> Dang, that was a pretty hard slap. Oh yeah, definite uh, motor mount shift. Oh, <laughs> can't keep the body on it. Nailed a rock. Oh, <laughs> almost cased the tractor.
just for the sake of experimentation, I'm going to try these Asuga wheels on this Typhon TLR tune. That'd be awesome. Uh, a little truckified platform. Again, it does have the 5mm hex extenders on it. And these tires fit right up. No rubbing anywhere. So it'd be pretty cool to see how they do. Of course, they're a little bit bigger diameter than standard buggy wheels. So let's see how she does. Oh, yeah. Now we're jumping good. <laughs> she keeps cutting off on me. It's the switch on the ESC. barely made that <laughs> man that was lucky oh look an ancient rc artifact hmm, that looks like a uh, x max tire <laughs> we better get that hide the evidence that guy's really digging these sugar tires on it handles a lot better than uh, the skeeter tires as far as agility goes Nothing like sending it to the sunset. All right, time for a field launch. Up she goes. Hot oh, damn, now I gotta go get it. Woo, on her feet. All right, time to give this Team Corrali Asuga XLR a rip. Uh, again, this thing is uh, so much fun. Um, completely bone stock, nothing upgraded on it. Still haven't broken anything, knock on wood. Uh, stock electronics, uh, everything stock except for a 16 tooth pinion. Uh, shocks are stock, stock fluids, diff, stock diff fluids, everything. So, all right guys, let's give her a rip. straight into a rock and it recovers <laughs> oh that was rough Again, almost made it. I keep casing the top, top edge. And she's over. Oh! Man, that was rough. That's what you call a send it and forget it. And then gotta go get it. Something funky with the front tire. Uh, popped a link. <clears throat> Was a pretty hard slap. See, should have knocked on wood. I did break that link right there. Maybe I can pop it on there, replace it real quick. Ooh! <laughs> Looks like it popped off again. At least it lasted for the jump.
Oh, just missed that log. 